A divided House officially approved ground rules today for the impeachment inquiry of President Donald Trump. And Arizona lawmakers were just as divided as the rest of the House, as Kaylee Broussard reports from our Washington Bureau. Republicans have complained for weeks that the House never officially voted to open an impeachment inquiry of President Donald Trump. Well, today they got that vote, but they were not happy. If this is about transparency, then open it up. If you want the American people to see it, open it up. Biggs was responding to the House resolution setting the ground rules for continuing the impeachment inquiry that began a month ago behind closed doors. The resolution passed 232 to 196 on a virtually party line vote. It's the first step toward an open hearing by the Judiciary Committee. But one member of that committee said the hearing should have been open from day one. The solution right here is a scam. When the Democrats say that it's open and transparent, that is a bunch of hogwash. It is the total opposite. Lesko said the resolution is little more than antics from the left. It authorizes them to continue these closed door secret hearings where me, a member of the Judiciary Committee, can't even go in. I can't even get a copy of the testimony. I've asked. I've been rejected. This is just wrong. House Speaker Nancy Pelosi said the vote will allow for transparency and that it's the Republicans who are balking. I don't know why the Republicans are afraid of the truth. Every member should support allowing the American people to hear the facts for themselves. This, that is really what this vote is about. Today's vote followed two hours of heated debate, and it comes more than a month after Pelosi announced an impeachment inquiry into whether Trump sought political favors from the Ukrainian president in exchange for U.S. aid to that country. The White House has repeatedly rebuked the probe calling the Democrats' efforts an unhinged obsession with an illegitimate impeachment proceeding. But most Democrats say this that Congress needs to stand up for itself and that the investigation is long overdue into an administration they claim is marred by corruption. Arizona Congressman Raul Grijalva told Cronkite News today's vote establishes the rules of the public hearings that will expose Trump's cover-ups, corruption, and shakedowns and Republicans will have to decide whether to defend a corrupt president or defend the Constitution they swore to uphold. The vote broke along party lines, with just two Democrats voting against the resolution and one independent voting for it. It was a straight party line vote for Arizona lawmakers. All five House Democrats were in favor, and all four Republicans were opposed. In Washington, Kaylee Broussard, Cronkite News.